Welcome to the course selection process presentation. Our goal today is to give you the necessary information to select courses for the 2018-2019 school year. You have been given several items, the course catalog, course selection sheet, and course request worksheet. At this time, please put your name on all three items. Keep them on your desk to refer to during this presentation. You will need a pencil or a pen to write with and a highlighter if you like. Let's take a look at the calendar for the course selection process. January 23rd, today, you are receiving the course selection information. January 26th, Friday, is the deadline for turning in your completed course selection information to your English teachers with required signatures. January 29th through February 16th, the counselors will meet with students during English classes to discuss classes for next year. The 2018-2019 course catalog will be helpful to you in making decisions concerning course selection. On page 9 are the high school graduation requirements. On pages 37 through 69 are high school course descriptions. The requirements for graduating under the Foundation High School Plan with endorsement are as follows. Four English classes, four math classes, four science classes, three social studies classes, two foreign language classes, one fine art, one PE, .5 credit of health, six electives which includes a communication skills component. The Distinguished Level of Achievement, DLA, may be earned by FHSPE students through successful completion of all requirements for the Foundation High School Program plus the requirements of at least one endorsement including Algebra 2 among the four required math credits and a fourth science credit. A student must graduate with a DLA to be considered for the top 10 percent in eligibility for automatic admission to a Texas public college or university. The different endorsements are STEM, Business and Industry, Public Services, Arts and Humanities, Multidisciplinary Studies. These are the requirements and options for STEM. The STEM endorsement specifies Algebra 2, Chemistry, and Physics as requirements. Requirements and options for business and industry. Requirements and options for public services. Requirements and options for arts and humanities. Requirements and options for multidisciplinary studies. As you choose your academic core classes, you will need to make some decisions about placement. Academic, pre-AP, or AP. The decision to enroll in a pre-AP or AP class rests with parents and students. However, the school can provide powerful input through teacher recommendations. Talk to your teacher about what they think is best for you. Please review the characteristics of the successful pre-AP student. Please read the entrance guidelines for high school pre-AP and AP classes. Also on page 16 of the course catalog are the exit guidelines from pre-AP AP courses. Please review them carefully as they have changed from previous years. Students will have the first six weeks to exit pre-AP or AP classes. Students must petition for this change. You will need to show you have conference with the teacher, completed all assignments, shown you have attended tutorials. Students maintaining a C average for the semester will not be changed from the class. The AP program offers college-level instruction to the academically successful student while in high school 
with the option of taking an advanced placement exam at the end of the course to possibly earn college credit. Discuss this option with your current teachers. Please look at page 16 for more information. This is a listing of the many AP courses available at Seven Lakes High School. Dual credit courses are offered through Houston Community College and are taught on the Seven Lakes campus. Students receive both high school and college credit. Enrollment in dual credit courses are subject to students meeting enrollment requirements. Please refer to page 17 and 18 in your course catalog for dual credit information. There will be a mandatory meeting this spring to explain enrollment procedures. The date and the time of this meeting is February 12th at 6.30 in the Seven Lakes High School 9th grade Commons. These are the courses available to satisfy your English requirements. In 10th grade, you have English 2, English 2 Pre-AP, English 2 Pre-AP GT. 11th grade, you have English 3, AP English Lang, AP English Lang GT. 12th grade, you have English 4, AP English Literature, AP English Literature GT, Dual Credit English 4, Humanities and Creative Writing. You need to check to see if the colleges you apply to will accept Humanities and Creative Writing as your fourth English. Here are some other options. Reading 1, Reading 2, Reading 3, Creative writing is either a full year or semester as an elective. This is the math course selection for 2018-2019. When choosing your math class for 2018-2019, carefully study the chart for the recommendations for the course. This is a list of math courses that will satisfy your third or fourth year of math. Information on these courses can be found on pages 40 through 42. You have Algebraic Reasoning, which has the prereq of Algebra 1, and Geometry as your third year math. There's Academic Statistics with the prereq of Algebra 1 and Geometry. Financial Math, prereq Algebra 1 and Geometry, it also can count as a third year math. And Discrete Math is the prereq, prereq of Geometry and Algebra 2 as your fourth math. Your current math teacher will make recommendations for your next year's math class. Science course selection. The following criteria will guide you in the recommendation process. Teacher recommendations will be given. Please pay close attention to all math requirements and students' grades. Tenth graders are allowed to take one science class per year. Eleventh graders may take two science classes per year. Twelfth graders may take two science classes per year. Social Studies course selection. Tenth grade, you may take Academic World History, Pre-AP World History, AP World History, or APGT World History. 11th grade have the options of U.S. History, AP U.S. History, APGT U.S. History, or HCC Dual Credit U.S. History. 12th grade, there's AP Government, APGT Government, HCC Dual Credit Government, Economics, AP Microeconomics, APGT Microeconomics, AP Macroeconomics, APGT Macroeconomics, and HCC Dual Credit Economics. Social study electives are AP European History, Pre-AP Psychology, AP Psychology, AP Human Geography, Sociology, or AP European History. Pre-AP Psychology is a prerequisite for AP Psychology. These are your options for physical education. 
you must take one credit of PE for graduation. Shown here are the regular PE options. Off-campus PE requires an application that is available in the counselor's office. The application must be submitted prior to the start of the semester. Athletics. These are the courses in the athletic block. Remember, if you're participating in several sports, circle the sport that comes first in the school year. You must have a coach's signature to enroll in an athletic course. It is important for you to remember that there are different substitutions for the PE requirement. There is regular PE, off-campus PE, trainer, dance team, fall semester of marching band, fall semester of color guard, cheerleading, or athletics. Remember, only the first year of cheerleading counts for credit. In this block, you see all of the foreign language available. French, German, Spanish, Japanese, Chinese, and American Sign Language. Remember, you must take two credits of foreign language under the FHSP plan and three credits under the DLA. Fine Arts. See pages 48 through 51 in the course catalog for available courses. If you are currently in band, orchestra, or choir, circle the level you are in at this time. After auditions in May, counselors will make the necessary adjustments to your schedule. There are several AP art classes. See Mrs. Glasgow for approval. Theater arts involves acting, and technical theater involves backstage sound, lighting, and sets. For theater arts 2 through 4, technical theater 2 through 4, and all theater production classes, you must have a teacher signature. The FHSP requires a communication component. Courses that satisfy this requirement are listed. Communication applications, professional communications, debate, oral interpretation, professional standard in ag business, teen leadership, theater, theater production, dual credit speech, and AP seminar. Journalism is on page 53 of the course catalog. Journalism is a prerequisite for being on the newspaper and yearbook. Page 53 in the course selection catalog lists technology courses available at Seven Lakes. Computer Science, AP Computer Science, AP Computer Science AB, Computer Science Independent Studies, Pre-AP, and AP Computer Science Principles. Technology. Page 54 in the course selection catalog lists technology courses available at Seven Lakes. Digital Art and Animation, which can count as a fine art credit, Advanced Digital Art and Animation, and Web Technologies. See pages 58 through 59 in the course catalog for information about the agriculture science classes. Many of the classes are one semester that anyone can take. Please ask Mr. Boche for more information. Architecture and construction. That's interior design and architectural design. Please see pages 59 through 60 in the course catalog for more details. Arts, AV Tech, and Communication. These courses include fashion design, commercial photography, and advanced commercial photography. It's video production. It's digital communications in the 21st century, which is Spartan time, year one, or digital design and media production, year two. Both of these courses require approval by Mr. Kolkman. Business courses are found on pages 61 through 63. These courses are vital in today's society. Our world demands you to be technology savvy and we expose you to numerous software which will help assist you explore your skills and interests which will help lead you to your career path. Several classes listed provide financial and marketing exploration. Career Prep is a work-based co-op program which includes classroom and a paid job. You must be 16 and have your own transportation. Marketing Sales and Services. 
There's more information about these courses on page 65 through 66 in your catalog. Health Science. Information about these courses are on page 66 through 67. That includes medical terminology, principles of health science, health science theory, anatomy and physiology. Principles of Health Science is a full year course that fulfills your health requirement. This course is a prerequisite for health science theory. EMT is a two period course and is open to seniors only. Human Services. Please see page 67 in the course catalog. That's Lifetime Nutrition and Wellness, which is called the Cooking Class. It's Interpersonal Studies, which is a semester class. It's Individual and Family Life. Child Development. Principles of Human Services, which is Personal and Family Development. And Dollars and Cents, which is a semester class. STEM. That's science, technology, engineering, and math. Please read page 69 in the course catalog. This includes principles of applied engineering, engineering design and presentation, engineering science. Education and training. That's principles of education and training, human growth and development. These are new courses being offered here at Seven Lakes High School 2018-2019. Non-credit courses. This slide shows a list of non-credit courses available to students. Miller Career Center. Courses are open to KDISD students currently classified as juniors. Certain courses with internships or work programs have an age requirement of 16 before participating in the off-campus training. All students must complete the application process to be considered for acceptance. Priority deadline for applications is February 9, 2018. Miller Career Courses are designated in the course catalog with the letter M. Choosing courses for next year. Students must be mindful of their endorsement. Choose core, which are required courses, and enough courses from other areas to complete seven full class periods. If one course marked semester is selected, a second semester class is also required. Review the course catalog when making selections. List alternate choices in the spaces provided. Turn in your course selection worksheet according to campus instructions. The students will meet with school counselor to review credits and finalize course request. Remember, elective changes for the 2018-2019 school year will not be granted after May 2018. The course request worksheet. This is due to your English teacher by Friday, January 26, with necessary signatures. You must list three alternate electives. This concludes today's presentation. Thank you for your attention. This presentation is now available online on the counselor's page.